What's going on, world of YouTube? Hey, uh, Justin ATV here with you. Got us a little uh, Harbor Freight tool haul. And I mean little, it ain't nothing extravagant, no, uh, you know, 20 different power tools. Just small tool haul. Uh, actually, two tools in it. That's it. Uh, first one. I've been wanting one of these for a while. I just couldn't kind of see paying $15 for one. Uh, they had the club card discount on it. I got it for 9 bucks. I figured, well, it's about the cheapest I've ever seen it. Might as well go ahead and get it. Uh, keep me just from throwing my box of gloves around. Uh, part number on it is 69322. Oh. Next. No. Gloves. Seven mil. They're nine dollars right now. The black nine mil are usually twelve ninety nine. Club discount. They're nine ninety nine right now. Um, I only want we got one box of the uh, nine mil thickness ones. Uh, I normally use the seven. They've worked out really good for me. Um, but I figured I'd give those uh, nine mils a try. So there's those. Um, you know, one of these little consumable uh, bit holders. Uh, it is magnetic. Normally two bucks. Yeah, ninety nine cent with a club card. Um, then I got thirty piece or thirty six, three eight steel stamping set. Um, part number on it, six zero six six nine. Um, lifetime warranty on them, believe it or not. Uh, something that's a lot of places see that could be a consumable. Um, the quarter inch set is on sale right now. Um, I don't know if anybody's ever really seen some of these. Um, it is got a little weight to it. Comes in a little plastic tray holder. But, you know, it's got A through Z and um, 0 through 9. It also has the AND uh, symbol in here. And da, 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 da. your O and the 0 are identical. Uh, you could, so you got to double up on that one. That, uh, you know. Let's see, I, I don't see any other special characters or anything in it. Uh, the only thing I would like to see on this would be, you know, uh, take the Z for matter of fact. You know, when, yeah, you can look at it and set it down. It'd just be nice and a whole lot faster if they would have... You know the numeric or the alphabetical letter that's uh, you know that you're going to be stamping. However, it is facing on here that you're going to stamp it would be on this side. But you know you really can't complain, which I'm not. It's just something I like to see. Um, I gave. Let's see where is it. Um, I actually got these on discount with a. 20% off um, coupon. They're normally $23 uh, with 20% off. It took $4.60 off and made it $18.39. So those are uh, kind of a rare thing to get or use. I mean, so I mean, there's really no sense going out and spend two, three hundred dollars on the set unless you're going to use them quite a bit. Um, last not least, but are one of the new Apache uh, rugged mobility cases that they've got. Um, this one here is the 1800. Says that they're waterproof, protective, can be used for camera equipment, electronics, tools, valuables. Says that it's weatherproof, dustproof, dust proof, and impact resistant. Um, it actually does have a little uh, valve right here to, um, you know, let it breathe. If you've just got it sitting in a closet or something of like that, uh, 
the thing's made out of tough ABS plastic. I reckon it's ABS plastic. Um, but the model number on this one is 63518. Um, made in China. But uh, it, it's not fire resistant. This thing will, will melt. But um, like I said, if you got sitting up in a closet, something like that, you know, you can let it breathe. But make sure you close that off. Um, it does have a spot on either end. You can put a lock, two uh, nice latches, nice rubber foam uh, gasket. Uh, well, they call that egg crate foam up top. Now, uh, the smaller case, it has got three layers of the foam that, you know, you just kind of rip and tear out however you need it. And then it's got a single piece of foam that's um, two-thirds the same thickness as this um, down in the bottom. Uh, I bought this to put my GoPro and my mic and stuff in. Um for when not in use, uh, you know, get knocked in the floor, or uh, if I decide I need to take it off the handlebar or the four wheeler or something, um, which don't get me wrong, I know the GoPro's waterproof and all that, but some of the uh, add ons for it are not. So, but uh, if I'm gonna end up going through a real brushy area or something, I don't want limbs and stuff smacking the camera so it's something I can put it in there protect it um, well guys any questions comments um, 